All right, everyone, you're welcome to this section. And um, as instructed by our CEO, the person of Mrs. Damilola Bakari Sanusi, she has instructed me to walk you through the step-by-step -step process on how to install the Microsoft Office tools on your laptop, the latest one, at least the 2021. If you want to do Excel without... Um, having issues with your um, applications, you need to have the latest Office tools, which is 2021 20, and above. So I'm gonna walk you through on how to install it without having to pay for any uh, license fee or, or any fee at all. So follow me as I walk you through. The first thing is we have to open our Window Explorer. You can also use the shortcut Window plus E. That's the shortcut to um, Window Explorer, but I can just open it like this. Having opened the Window Explorer, we'll go to our PC, this PC, and then we'll open our Local Dix, the Local Dix um, that has something like this, Local Dix C, then you open it. And then we open a folder, a new folder, and name it MS, Office set up. So we have named it MS Office Setup. Please take note of the name and take note of where the folder is. So the next thing that we're going to do right now is to go to our Google browser and then we're going to search for Microsoft Customization Tools. So you search for Microsoft Customization Tools. When you click it open, you, you, you click this Office Customization Tools Admin Center. Make sure you, this is what you are clicking. All right, so now it has opened. You want to take note of the following. Um, there is 32 bit here, there is 64 bit here. Now, this bit has to match with the bit of your system. So, find out what bit is your system. Now, the system I'm using is using 64 bit. So, I'm going to be leaving it at 64 bit. Now, yours may be 32 bit and um, yours may be 64 bit, but kindly find out about it. About If you go to about the system, when you type about on your search bar, it's going to show you about your PC. You type about on your search bar, you click on it, it's going to show you um, about your PC. So right here, this is where I get to know if my PC is 64. When you look at system type, you see 64-bit operating system. So that's that, that means my system is using 64-bit. So when you search yours, you get to know if your system is using 64-bit or 34-bit. So because what you are clicking here in this Microsoft customization tools must be in line with your system your laptop or your pc so after that we move to product then we click on the product that we want we want we are looking at office ltls c professional plus 2021 volume license so this is the one we are clicking and after you've done that then you move down to language you search for language then you set the language, set primary language to matching operating system. Then that is all. Then the next thing is to export. So we click on the export um, button. Now in here, you have three options. Keep current setting, office open XML format, open document format. So you may want, you will want to click on the office open XML format. Please take note of that. Very important. Office open XML format and after that you scroll down and press OK When you press OK, it's going to give you this prompting you click on accept. I accept the terms in the license agreement and Then you click on export When you export it downloads automatically and so what you do when it downloads automatically is you go to your window explorer you go to your download this is it you move it Control x you press Control plus x or you right click your mouse and um 
you cut you click on cut do not copy make sure you cut it like you are moving the whole of the file itself so where are we moving it to we are moving it to this pc and then we open our local disk then we open that file that we have that folder that we have opened already in the pc which is ms office setup then we click it open and then we paste it here right so that steps is done then we go to our google browser again and then we search for microsoft deployment tool this is the drop down button microsoft deployment tool you click on it download office deployment tools you click on it and then you come to where to here and then you download it has downloaded all right so i'm going to go to my download again oh it downloaded two times so we just need only one so i'm going to delete the second one and i'm going to take this i'm going to cut it move it to this pc local disk and i'll paste it inside the microsoft office folder right so having done that we need to run we need to install this deployment tool right now so we double click on it then we it's going to give you a prompting to either click yes or no do you want to allow this app to make change to your device then you click yes then you agree and then you continue so it's going to give you a prompting that you should um, um, save the installment in a particular folder so we're going to look for the folder in our this pc so um this pc look at dixie and then microsoft office setup this is where we want to save it in so we click on ok so the file is extracted successfully you can see it has shown here that it has been extracted so after you are done with those two steps the third step is to go to your search bar every laptop has a search bar you search for command right before you finish spelling it you have bring it out command then you see something like this command prompt okay then you click on command prompt then you come here to run as administrator do you want to allow this app to make change to your device you click on yes so it's going to open um a command prompt then you are going to carefully type the following command prompt all right first we're going to type cd and this then you press enter then you're going to type cd all right space c this sign slash ms office setup remember this is the name of our folder if you store the folder with different name it's not going to the command prompt is not going to read it remember this is the name that we use to save our folder here so the command is going to look for this make sure that the way it's spelled here that's the way you spell it in the command prompt okay so let's go back to the command prompt you have to make sure that the way it is on the folder that's how it will be here on the command prompt office set up right so having done that you click on enter so it has the command prompt i've seen it so the next thing to do is set up dot exe setup.exe and then ensure you press space then you press this and then you press configure you type configure 
space, then you type configuration dot xml and then you press enter then you see that your microsoft will start installing automatically by itself so you can see it's giving you a prompting that is installing so you can see the open page now you just have to stay online and show you have at least up to one gig plus data to stay online so that it can fully install right so it's kind of like installing right now So you can see it is 7% already. So once it gets to 100%, then it has successfully installed. The moment it shows like this, it's an indication that it is successfully installed on your laptop. Now you can begin to work with the Microsoft Office 2. So we're going to close this, and then we're going to close this. And then we're going to go to our PC where we have this file. We are no longer in need of this file, so we're going to delete it. And then we're going to search for our, let's search for Word. So we can see Microsoft Word is already installed. Let's search for Excel. And the Excel is already installed. Excel is already installed on your laptop without um, you don't have to pay for anything. It's free and it's opening, it's functioning properly. And it's functioning properly. All right? So that's how you install Microsoft Office 2 on your PC. Thank you for watching. So go ahead and install yours on your PC.